Hi baby dolls, welcome to Vlogmas 2018. And so I have a Goodwill haul for y'all. I have a lot of Christmas items. I don't know, it just seems like, you know, when Christmas time comes, it's really, really a good time to really get some good quality items from the Goodwill, in my opinion. And so I wanna share with you some of the items that I did purchase. I already have so much Christmas stuff in my collection through the years, but it's always really nice to add into my collection and the holiday time is really a good time to you know add some more pieces and so i wanted to show you this was a beautiful card right here that my mother gave me i believe in 2016 and i just wanted you to know that you two baby dolls are a wonderful reflection of god's love and so merry christmas to you i do hope that you are enjoying these vlogmas videos it's really fun filming them for you and so let's go ahead and get into the haul so the first thing i want to showcase is this beautiful godiva candy box um of course um you know there were already chocolates in here but i just really loved the detailing here that says godiva and I paid 99 cents for this. And I love uh, the way that this feels. It's felt. And I love like the little quilting throughout it. And you just um, open it up. And it's just a basic box. But I thought that, you know, it was really well kept. It's nice and clean. And so I plan on actually uh, hosting a holiday party in about a week or so a week from today actually and i'm gonna put some chocolates in here may not be godiva who knows i may may put some godiva chocolates in here that would be wonderful but i just thought that this was just so beautiful to display on one of my tables for the party all right also i found these beautiful hand painted plates they are gigantic it's going to be so beautiful on top of a charger and I'm going to use these plates this season because this year we're doing kind of a like a New England Christmas theme, traditional theme. And these plates are going to be wonderful. I love the way that it kind of like the way that the crafter made it look like these plates were old and worn to make it more traditional. Just love those beautiful uh, poinsettias. And then you see Christmas displayed in a different way. And these originally came from linens and things okay and as you see it says dishwasher safe made in china and some of the plates not this one okay yeah it does say hand painted individually handcrafted and hand painted and so do you see that distressing around there i just loved it loved it loved it and so this is going to go really beautiful on my tablescape um uh, this christmas and who knows i may share that with you all right, and I also found some really, really old school. Well, they're made to look old school, but they're brand new, basically. But some cute stockings, okay? These are genuine, authentic stockings. Um, the letters, they don't have any representation for me and my family. Um, but nonetheless, when I find stockings like this, who cares, right? And so... Um, it's this beautiful knitted. It's actually lined. Very, very well quality, good quality stockings. This is what they look like. So I paid $1.91 for these stockings. And then here's the red. And it's lined in red satin. So we can always say that the G is for God. The J is for Jesus. And the K is for, I don't know whatever you want it to be for. If your name starts with the K, leave me down, leave me in the comment section below and say, hey girl, my name is Kathy or Kathleen or Kitty Cat. <laughs> All right, girls. And so I got these for $1.91 each and I just thought that these were so amazing, fabulous quality, cannot beat that at all. So I'm gonna leave these down here, Um, I think. I don't want this white one to get dirty. So, whoops, we better do that because we don't want to show the randomness that's down underneath the table. And so let's just hope that what I'm getting ready to show you here, I'll just put this plate here because the next thing that I want to show you are actually is a wreath. So hold on for one moment. 
I got this wreath. I'm not going to be able to show it all to you, but it's basically a beautiful wreath. Can you see that? And I got this for $2. It's really, really big, gigantic with the beautiful cones and everything. And so I like to get these when I see really good quality wreaths. And then I will just revamp it a little bit and add some little things into it. But for $2, girl, I had to get that for sure. All right. Also, stay tuned for part two of this video. I'm going to show you some other items that I got at the Goodwill at phenomenal prices. Okay, so now I want to show you. I just, I don't know. I went back and forth whether or not to get these ornaments. But girl, when you see what's inside here, you're going to see exactly why I got them. So I got this big bag of goodie ornaments, goodie good ornaments for $4.94. And I, you know, the, the bag is clear. And so you're able to see some things in here, but there were just so many things that I thought were going to be impeccable. So I thought I wanted to go ahead and get it and see what was in there. So I'm going to put you here on my little stand. And let's see, we'll just do this because I want to really show these to you. Do it this way. All right, so now the little angel's cut off. I don't want her to be cut off. Sorry, girls. All right, and so now let's go ahead and look inside this goodie bag and see what are the ornaments that are in here. I'm so excited. And so, I've already opened it a little bit, so we're gonna be discovering these together. All right, let's go ahead and turn you this way. All right, so I got this bag because I saw these beautiful horses and looks like that is that leg broke off that's okay because you can just turn him this way and then you would not know that the leg is broken but I just thought that these look so old school traditional so cute I love horses and so look at his tail it's <laughs> so cute and it's got like a little glitter on it so I got that one and then I don't know another reason why I like thrift store items is because they have a history you know these used to be in someone's home and someone cherished these at one point in time and so I just love it so they're broken a little bit but that's okay I'm okay with that because again, these have a history, all right? And when you're putting them down in the tree and stuff, you're not gonna see all that. So you'll just, um, I'll just arrange them in a way where you cannot see their flaws. But the main thing is, is the head and the mane is still there. So those are cute, so I got two of those. And then this is really why I wanted this bag. Again, I mentioned to y'all before that I love pearls. It's kind of hard to get this one out of here. We'll have to dig in a little deeper before I can show you that one. But look at this. I love angels too. Look at this beautiful angel cherub. He's so big and chunky. He's got both of his wings. It's made out of plastic, but so cute. So cute. We'll just sit him here so he can just chill out with us for a little while. Love him. He kind of reminds me of one of my cousins that passed away. All right. And so let's see. Here's another horse. These are like the merry-go-round horses. So see this? Look at this. This one is, is complete. He's got all of his everything. He's got his hooves. I love it. So cute. Oh my gosh. 
So we'll sit him over in a different area since he's got all his things going on. Oh my gosh, look at this one. She's good to go too. She's got everything. She's got her hooves. She's got all kind of peach adornment with those beautiful little flowers. I love these. Oh, stunning, stunning. So at least we've got two horses. So see, even if these were $2 each, we've already got our money's worth. And do I love them? I love them. So I'm good with the two horses and the beautiful cherub already has paid for this box or for this goodie bag. Or should we call it a blind bag? Kind of. Okay, so just digging around. Oh my gosh, I've never seen anything like this in my life. Look at this. is like a love seat. It's a love seat ornament. Kind of like a French provincial. Totally my style. Love her. She's got the cute little bow on the seat. That is so cute. Oh, that's so... See, that's why I love this stuff. It's so unique. And then, oh my gosh, this is why I got the bag right here. For this lovely beauty right here. This pearl-esque ornament. I've never seen anything like this in my life. Faux pearls. I love it. I might even leave this one in the boutique because I love it so much. So beautiful. Love it. Leave me a comment in the section in the comment section down below and let me know which one of these ornaments are your favorite. Now see, here's a broken up horse here, so I'll probably go ahead and let this one go just because it looks like well, no, I guess all of her things are here. It just kind of looks like something's missing up here. I don't know. This one's broken up pretty bad. So, I don't know. I'll probably have to go ahead and let her go. But, nonetheless, you know, you're going to get some hit or misses in these kind of bags. All right. Now, here's one. Here's a completed one. She's pretty. Oh, so pretty. Oh, no, the tail is gone. The tail is gone. So see, if I was a real major crafter, I could take this broken one's tail and put it on her somehow. But nonetheless, so there is also so far, it looks like I've gotten two complete horses. Carnival horses. Here's a cute little ornament. All right, nothing special, but still Christmassy. This will probably go on the tree this year. And then this one, it's nice. I love it. However, it's a little bit too yellowish for this year, but I may put it near the tree and see, you know, if it's gonna work or not. All right. And then, I love these. These are mirrored ornaments. Okay. It's the mirror. Show it that way. It's very, very castle-esque or chateau. And actually, we call our home a chateau. So, we, there's a name that we call it. And... I may put that on the tree this year. We'll see. So I'm still digging a little bit, trying to get this thing off of here. Doesn't look... Oh. Some of the stuff gets tangled up. Here's another ornament. This one's a little different. They're unique. And this is real mirror. So these are these are really good quality ornaments, this one and this one. So we'll definitely put these on the tree this year. And here's another cherub. So beautiful. 
go ahead and chill out. And then, voila, we've got one more horse, a merry-go-round. That's what these are. As we come to the end of this video, I finally figured out these are merry-go-round horses. Okay. So cute. So we've got one complete horse, another complete horse, and another. So we've got three horses that worked out, and then four horses that didn't quite work out, but we'll still maybe work with them. And then last but not least, we've got another one of these palace ornaments with the mirror. Beautiful. So baby dolls, this is my Goodwill haul. I hope that you're having a good day. I hope that you're enjoying this holiday season as I am. I'm almost complete with everything that I need to do. And so uh, let's go ahead and continue on with the holiday season. I love you, but God loves you so much more. Pretty is as pretty does. Bye-bye.